Thanksgiving is coming a day early for these families. I'm Malia Thomas in Valdosta, and I made my way over to Second Harvest in ADM Valdosta's Thanksgiving for Thousands Drive, where holiday cheer and free meals can be found. <laughs> what has been the most rewarding aspect of your day today? Just helping and putting smiles on people. Meet Gerard Mack. He's a sophomore at Valdosta High School and is spending his Thanksgiving break volunteering to help feed his fellow Valdostans. A lot of people, I don't even been around in that situation before so I know how it feels and then to now grow up out of that knowing I was there at one point I know what it feels like to help it put so much miles in my face. There's no shortage of neighbors that need help. Franklin Richards, president and CEO of Second Harvest, tells me that they have seen over 700 cars have come through the site today. Uh, we will be giving away a little over a quarter million pounds of food. And that's just a dent in managing food insecurity. I checked with the USDA. The country is undergoing its largest hunger increase since 2008. This year, food inflation has gone up by 4.7% and it's been on the rise for the last two years. For perspective, the average price of one pound of ground beef was $3.73 in 2019. Now, it's $5.34. Gerard tells me that giveaways like these, especially at this time of year, makes a key difference. I always say, what are you thankful for? But it's always no one thing to be in particular to be thankful for because you have so much to be grateful for. Second Harvest has additional resources for those who couldn't make it, and I'll link those in the web article. I'm Malia Thomas reporting for ABC 27.